of you at Satui Cantina Animal Kingdom. We're coming at you today. Vacations. You know we love to help families like you save time, save stress, save hassle, and create extra magic on those Disney and Universal destination vacations and more. And today I got some special guest stars. Where are they at? <laughs> I have I have Sarah and David. Hi. Sarah is one of our newest travel planning genies. She's joining us today. She's originally from West Virginia. Yep. And then we have David, her amazing husband. And then behind that we have Terry and Laura. <laughs> Laura, is another, Laura is another one of our amazing travel planners. You recognize her. And then, of course, we have Terry, her amazing husband. And hopefully, we did not all order the same exact food for this dining review. I don't remember what we ordered. But let's go inside and let's check out Satui Canteen. All right, so our order is ready. So we are going to go right inside and hopefully pick it up. And it's a pretty big order. Yes. We we got to show them our mobile order. All right, so it can be a challenge to find a place to sit, especially when you have more than five people. But the good news is, is that when you have more than five people, you divide and conquer, okay? <laughs> so David went and got drinks and silverware and all the things. I actually asked a cast member and they were really kind. They were trying to help us as best they could. Um, and then me, Sarah, and Terry, and Laura, we all split up and we found one. And of course, once we found one place, a better place opened up too. So we have a nice big table um, and uh, we are ready to divide and conquer. I'm just going to give you guys a quick shot of like us about to devour and conquer our food. All right. Look at all that amazing food we have. They are about ready to eat today. And my hand is in the way of Laura's Hello. face. Laura and David ordered the uh, cheeseburger bowies, which are like steam pork. Well, not only they be like pork buns, but they're steam. They're cheeseburger buns, is what they are, with uh, chips. And then uh, Sarah got the chicken bowl. I got the chicken and beef bowl with uh, sweet potatoes as my uh, my main under. I was gonna say underbelly. I don't even know what that means. Uh, my base. foundation, my base. Thank you, David. My base. Um, Sarah, what was your underbelly or your, I don't know why I keep saying underbelly, your base. <laughs> Rice and beans. Rice and beans. And then Terry got the chicken. Noodles. With noodles. So we are really trying everything today. That's perfect. That's amazing. And then of course I couldn't pass off the, uh, the hot dog. Boop. So we're going to do that for sure. Um, and then we got the blue, uh, cheesecake, I think is what it is. The cheesecake. So we're gonna try all the things right now. So Laura said, reminded me that my key word this year is courage. And she said I needed to muster up the courage and try it because I usually don't have steamy things. It's not as bad as I thought, you guys. I told right. you, it's a cheeseburger. I, I mean, if you I like pray. cheeseburgers, if you like cheeseburgers, you will love this. It's David is a braver person than I than I am. <laughs> yes, absolutely. But um, I, that's all I'm having, Laura. I have my bite. Now let's let's try this. Try the hot dog. Look how good that bread looks. That looks fully cooked, unlike the other one. <laughs> oh my god. This is like has like a honey butter on top, you guys. This is really good. Kid tested, adult approved, okay? <laughs> or the other way. Oh, that's delicious. This reminds me of one of those foods that you're like, I'm supposed to eat that? Let's see. <laughs> I really don't know how to describe this. That's the problem. I'm gonna. I'm going inside for the purple stuff. I think that's the actual cheesecake. I don't know. I don't know, you guys. I Okay, I'll just be honest and say I probably won't get this again. <laughs> like, I don't... 
I don't know. Like, it does taste bad, but it's not like, oh my gosh, this is the best dessert ever. We're going to let I, I just want to poke well, at David it. try. David just wants to poke at oh, it. Oh, yeah. Looks, I thought it was like a hard shell. Like a no, candy it's shell, not a it's, candy shell. Oh, no. It's almost like a cream cheese texture. Yeah, it is a cream cheese texture. Kind of, I think it's supposed to be blueberry or something. Yeah, it's cheese. not super flavor. It's got a little sweetness to it, but... But isn't it so beautiful for those Instagram? Oh, it is Instagram. Just make all your friends jealous. No, I don't like it. <laughs> so, as you can see, Laura couldn't continue filming me because she thought it was so funny. It My was facial hilarious. expression. <laughs> I know that a lot of bloggers, a lot of people, absolutely swear by that. It's one of the best desserts in the world. My question for you is. Why are you guys not ordering Hongo Olympia right outside of Avatar? The pineapple cream cheese spring rolls? Like, yes. those are delicious, okay? Why are we not ordering that? Why are we coming into Sato Weekend Keen and ordering whatever that thing is? I'd have to look at the menu and remember what it is. The blue cream cheese... Blueberry. Blueberry cream cheese blueberry. ice... What is the, the cake called? Cream cheesecake thing. Yes, why are we ordering that? Go and get the Pongo Olympia, all right? If you guys want to see a review of that, check out our best treats at Animal Kingdom. All right, so we're going to do a recap and ask everybody what they thought about their food. And we all know what everybody thought about the dessert. I don't think anybody liked the, the blueberry uh, cheesecake thing. And by the way, I don't know what that green thing was that I thought was white chocolate. I It had an aftertaste that is indescribable. And I will not be doing that again. So Sarah, tell us what you thought about your food. I thought it was really good. It was just a little bit spicy, but very tasty. Would you eat it again? That's the question. I would. I would eat it again. Oh, oh, from a one being, I will never touch that again, to ten being, oh my gosh, to give me it for Thanksgiving, what would it be? <laughs> I would say a 6.5. <laughs> okay, all right. That will not be at her Thanksgiving dinner then, but she would eat it again. It's, uh, do you think it's better than Flame Tree Barbecue? No. <laughs> <laughs> no. Okay, Laura, what about you? I had the cheeseburger bow buns, and they're good, but I had the child hot dog, a bite of the child hot dog after that. Totally doing the hot dog next time. The buns have a lot of bread. They're very steamy, as Brandon says. So, no, I will not order these again. I will order a hot dog again, and it would be a two on a Thanksgiving dinner. A two? Meaning we're not happy. But you said you like them. I mean, they're good, but no, there's still many things that are better. What is your favorite thing at Animal Kingdom? I do like that lumpia. Yeah, the Pongo lumpia? I like that lumpia. That's yeah, delicious. it is good. Thank you guys so much for watching one of our another amazing videos. Make sure you hit that like and subscribe button if you haven't already so you don't miss any of our amazing new videos. We are Magicland Vacations with Disney and Universal Travel Planning Experts. And make sure if you haven't already, check out our website, MagicLandVacations.com. There you can schedule a consultation with one of our amazing experts. And guess what? We do way more than just Disney and Universal Vacation, so definitely want to check us out there. Also, make sure you go to our private Facebook group, Travel Genie Fan Club, where we do giveaways and trivia contests every single month. And of course, I have some two other amazing videos for you to watch, one right over here and run right over there. One right there and one right there. I think I would start with that one. Or maybe that one. Or maybe that one.